Hello, cats and kittens. Uh, my name is Salty Tabby, and today we're playing something new. <gasps> so I'm actually pretty excited about this one. Uh, we're playing Slime Rancher 2. Uh, I played completely the first Slime Rancher. I got all the achievements. I got all the slimes. I loved that game. Like, adored it. So I am super excited to be playing the second one. So, uh, yeah, let's just, let's just go. Ooh, uh, save icon. Uh, where is... Come on. Nope. 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 <gasps> there it is! The Tabby! Tabby slime! Tutorials, sure. Tar, yeah. Feral, yeah, okay. I don't know what any of this means, but we're just gonna go. <laughs> oh, little Lumo slimes. They're so cute. There's gonna be new slimes. I'm excited. I don't, like, I saw some of the icons, but I don't really know anything about the new slimes. After a long day of slime ranching, Beatrix LeBeau was enjoying a cool glass of carrot juice as she watched the sun set across Slime Sea. Suddenly, a boat arrived at her dock with nothing inside but a mysterious letter. Hmm. You have explored the far, far range from the dusty shores of the dry reef to the furthest reaches of the perilous glass desert. But there are worlds yet uncharted. Beatrix LeBeau, Rainbow Island awaits you. Climb aboard if you're ready for a new adventure. For some reason, my model is lagging terribly, and I don't know how to fix that. So, uh, you're just gonna have to bear with me while the cutscene makes it do that, I guess. Uh, Beatrix excitedly boarded the boat and took it across the slime sea. Eventually, she saw an island unlike anything on the far, far range. Mountains, trees, and grasses, and an array of colors that danced and moved like a dream. Ooh! Oh, look at the feather! As she explored, she found an abandoned conservatory overlooking the rest of the island. Curiously... It was equipped with everything a slime rancher like her could ever need to wrangle slime, start a farm, and build gadgets. <laughs> and so a new adventure begins. Beatrix tightened her boots, readied her backpack, and set out to explore Rainbow Island and uncover its mysteries. Okay. Let's see. I think, uh, I think, yep, okay, the model isn't lagging anymore, so I think it just does that in, um, uh, cutscene for some reason. I noticed it did that a little bit in Cult of the Lamb, but it was mostly just when we were in, uh, uh, like, trying to, uh, get more, like, crafting buildings, buildings to craft and stuff in that menu. That was the only time I really saw it lag there. Um, and it did a little bit in Stray as well, we were in cutscenes. I'm gonna have to see if I can figure out how to fix that. I don't know why it's doing it, but we'll see. Um, yeah! Oh, wow, look at this place. It's beautiful. It's like a giant greenhouse. How to vac. Oh, I know how to vac. Let's go grab a slime. Come here. And we go boop, and he out he goes! Oh! Okay, so we have pink boy. Oh, we have a chicken. I know it's not called a chicken here, it's called a... I don't remember what it's called, but I know it's not chicken. Let me go get some more of these pink guys. Here, oop, I accidentally... <laughs> Shot him out. Come here, buddy! Yeah! This game is so heckin' cute. Look at him! Ah. Okay, what are we doing? Uh, shoot slime through the... Oh yeah, yeah, we have to put them in their little... So we have to, basically, uh, as, it, as the name implies, we are farming slimes. So these little guys, uh, when you give them a food, like a chicken, hen hen, that's what they're called, they'll eat it, and they'll poop out those little things. It's called a plort. You want a plort? Give me, oop, I did not mean to do that. Give me the plort. Yeah. Okay. And these plorts can be sold for sick cash. So you go over here and... Uh, there we go. 
And this will show you the port market. Shows you how much everything's worth. I guess it all has all the ones I've already seen. I wonder if that does that if you've already played the game or not. Hmm. Well, there's some carrots. There's a carrot. Uh, so, right now all we have is pink slimes, but there's a lot of different slimes. Uh, oh. <gasps> Baby chickens. Chickadoos. Keep these little guys in our pack for a little bit. We need to be able to make, uh, like a pen for the chickens. Um... Probably put it away from our pink slimes, just in case. I don't want them to get out and like mess stuff up. Do we have? We have just enough money for coop, so we're gonna do it. There we go. Boop boop. There go chicky doos. Alright, so they'll grow in there and make more of themselves. I think I need a rooster for them to really make more of themselves, but a rooster row as they call it. Oh. System offline? Why? Hmm. Well, now I guess we just go explore. It's all we can do. I like the grass. I think it looks a lot nicer than the first game. Rainbow fields. <gasps> Come here. Yoink. Come here, you. Hmm. We're also on the lookout for food things. Oop, there's another one. Yoink. <gasps> there we go, carrots. We need to grab these before they're eaten. Hey, little pink guy. Oh, and there's some fruits. So, um... Different slimes will eat different types of food. Pink ones, these guys will eat anything you give them. It does not matter what you give them. They will eat it all. Carrots, fruits, chicken, no matter what. Um, but there are some who only eat fruit, only eat veggies, or only eat meats. What is that? It's a rabbit! Cotton slime! Oh my goodness, they must love carrots. It's a good thing I have a bunch of carrots. Hello, little buddies! Oh my goodness, they're adorable! I mean, a bunch of these. Hello, come here. Come here. Come here, you. Yes. These carrots. Right now, I can only hold 20 of each item in my little thing down there. Oh, there's a... Mm, I want that chicken. Come here. Oh, no, no, come here. What do I do? Here, well, here's what I'll do. I don't need the pink slime so much. But I want this chicken. Come here. Hen, hen. And we do not have room for more of those. But we'll get a few more of these guys. We got ten of them. Ten rabbits. I feel like they probably bounce pretty well, which I'm a bit concerned about, but we'll see. Need more fruits. There's a few of each types of things. Like, there's a couple different types of, of vegetables. Uh, I think there's, like, beets and carrots and some other stuff. And then there's, like, round fruits and square fruits and fancy things like that. And then we have a couple different types of hens. And each slime has their, like, favorite favorite thing. Let's give them some foods. Give them the pogo fruits. Mm, so I really don't actually have any place to put these slimes that I've collected, I just realized. Because I don't have any monies. But I will go put this chicken away and we'll get some plorts. And that's what we'll have to do. There. There you go, chicky. Go there. And if we can get some plorts, we can get some money. So as long as they're well fed and not like hungry, they will stay inside there for the most part. At least the pink ones will. Oops. Come back. Some of them are problematic. I right, see now we have 32 monies, which still isn't really enough for anything. So, um, oh, chicken. You can't be there. That's a dangerous place. They'll eat you. Go over here. Eh. There we go. Keep the chicken safe. Okay, um... What we really need to do is make another pen for these cotton slimes. We don't really have the 
the space for that yet. So we're gonna go get a couple more pink ones so we can give them more fruit. Come here, buddy. Boop. Mm -hmm. There's also like secrets in this game, like new places you can go and things. Oh, hey, it's water. Upgrade is needed to harvest this. Water. Yeah, you can uh, spray stuff thing with water. There's like a water tank at some point you get. Some other stuff. There's like upgrades. I need, I need you, you. I need you. And we'll grab you. And you. And I think that'll give us a couple of... Are you gonna eat that? <laughs> Come here. Yeah, oh yeah, it says when you grab them what, what their diet is. Interesting. Hmm. I don't think I did that in the first game. I think you had to kind of figure it out on your own. Oh well. If you get too many slimes in one area, they can kind of... See how they're stacking on each other right there? They can do that, and they'll end up be being able to get out, which is a problem. You don't want them to get out. Oops, that's not what I wanted. And there we're out of fruits. Now they're eating. Making those plorts. I just wanna... Eh, gimme. Oops, I accidentally took the fruit. Excuse me, excuse me, I need that plort. Eh, nope, not them. <laughs> not you. <laughs> Eventually there's like upgrades you can do to the pens to make them higher or to put a thing on it that'll suck up the plorts automatically so you don't have to like wade through slimes in order to do it. No, we still don't have enough for another pen, I don't think. I think that was like 200 and something. Hmm. Let me see. Corral. Yeah, 250. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep exploring. I'm gonna keep these 10 cotton slimes and these 20 carrots. Um, until I can find some more guys to give it to. Actually, what I can do here. You want that? There we go. We can just give these guys some carrots and get some plorts from them. They don't have to be ours to get plorts. Yeah, there we go. We'll just grab another carrot. Oops, no, no, no! I did not mean to give you all of that. Well, it's okay. Usually if they're full, they won't give you another plort, but that guy gave two, so I don't know what's going on there. The reason I'm going back even after doing this is uh, mostly just because uh, I don't want to have that slot filled in case we find something new. Um, so I could have done this game on stream, like stream Slime Rancher, but there is a reason for I have not do done this thing. There is a reason I have not. And um, the reason I am doing this in individual videos instead of streaming it is because I get very easily motion sick. And Slime Rancher, at least the first one, was one of those games I got really easily motion sick on. So I couldn't play it for long periods of time. Oh my goodness. Okay, so... Oh, there's some Lumo Slimes. So you see how there's the, these pink, big pink bunny now. Big pink bunny boy. Uh, when they pawed out a plort after eating, if another slime finds that plort and eats it, then they'll combine into a bigger slime. Combination slime. Right there. No, I want that. No, leave it alone. No! Oh, I wanted that plort. Heck. Oh, well. Oh, my Largo. Yeah, they're called Largo slimes. They're a big boy. They give two times the plorts, because they give a small plort. They give one of the regular original plorts they were, and then the other plort, so they'll give two. One of each of what they were, originally. I have no idea how much these cotton plorts sell for. But we're gonna find out. Actually, I could probably do that. Just throw some cotton plorts around in my area, even outside of their pen, and just give them some carrots and see what happens. We're almost uh, to getting another um, pen. <gasps> A rooster! Oh, I need that. Hold on. You gotta go put all these plorts away. Grab that rooster. Eh. Ooh, those gave a good amount. Mr. Rooster, 
We need you. Where'd he go? Where's he? Oh, there he is. Come here. Yes, Roostro. So he will help us actually make more baby chickens. More chickies. Oop. Yes, good. So we have three babies. One mama hen and then a big boy here. Daddy. Good. Good, good. Alright, so what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna pop out one of these slimes. Boop. They only eat veggies. See that one? Only eats veggie. Here. Have a carrot. Boop. Yeah. Yeah. already eaten. Oh no! Oh wait, they don't eat you. You only eat veggie. Hmm. Carrot for you. Carrot for you. There we go. Gotta get those other two over there that are hopping around. Come here. E. E. Give me these carrots. Now we can plunk these right in there. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, we're like one short. Okay. We're getting there. You. Eat this. Yum. Good boy. Alright. Now we get those other four bunnies back. We need them still. Can't have them going anywhere. Where did the other one go? There he is. Come here. Yoink. Honestly, I probably should have made a carrot farm before making the chicken thing. I just was in such a rush. Eh, there we go. That should be enough. We will make this not right next to the pinks, because if we make it right next to the pinks, they might combine. Yes. There we go. There we go. And one, two, three, four, five. I don't know which one of you guys are still hungry, but whichever one of you guys are still hungry, you can eat. Eat! Oh, they bounce so high. Alright. Have to scoop them all up in order to get their ports. Somebody didn't eat. Hmm. Who didn't eat? Who hasn't eaten yet? One of y'all hasn't eaten yet. Oh well, we'll leave it to me. We'll leave it to me. It's fine, it's fine. Go put these fluff plorts, cotton plort, away. Look at this, we're already back up to 100. Now we're gonna go explore some more. Put the cute bunnies. Hmm. Alright. Let's go take a look. There's pink. Uh, we're not gonna deal with the Lumos slimes until we can get like an actual place for them because they disappear if it becomes daytime. So we need a special pen for them so they won't disappear. Um, I love plorts. Boop. Let's see, what is this? Upgrade is needed to harvest. There's a lot of plorts down here. Eh. Now we're just kind of getting plort so that we can- don't you get- oh, oh, no, a phosphor slime. That's what they're called. Glowy slime guy. At the moment we're just trying to get as many plorts as we can, make some money so that we can get more pens for stuff. That's the name of the game. Hello, little cheeky. E. E. That'll do. Now how do we get back from here? Do we have a map? I don't know. Hmm. Oh, this is, looks familiar. I think we go this way from here. So we got 15 plorts of that and one of those. Should be able to go sell these. Eh. It's gonna be a lot of back and forth at the beginning. Oh, little Lumoses. They're very cute. Chickadoo. 
floor. Cotton floor. Oh no! The pinks are escaping! Come back here! No, I can't grab them yet. Eh, hold on. Yeah, see, they're hungry, that's why they're escaping. Okay. <sighs> Give them some of these carrots, because they get hungry. Pinks are ravenous. Come back here! Where are you going? Buddy. I understand you're hungry, but you need to be in there to eat. See, if they get hungry, they'll try and escape, which is not good. You don't want that. Ugh. Ugh, so close. Put these chickadees in here. Oh yeah, some of them grew up. And there's more now. Grab two of these chickens. Since there's a bunch of baby chicks. We'll take two of these chickens and we'll give them to the pinks. Give them some more food. Oh wow, they made a lot of plorts in there. That should be enough to make another thing. Here we go. And then I'm gonna make a carrot place, because we do that for the rabbits too. Whee! Good, good, good. Alright, uh, we'll put the carrot one right next to the bunnies, I think. Mm. Look, look. Somebody else ate a food. Good. We'll put this... Oh, chicken! Come back! What are you doing there? Uh, we're gonna make... Garden! Bye. Yes. Then we put... Put a carrot in there, and now carrots are growing. So now we don't need these carrots. We can throw them in here with the rabbits. So we have two corrals. One for pinks and one for rabbits. Once I get the amount of money I need to make the walls higher in those corrals, uh, then I will start combining them to make bigger slimes. But for now, we're not going to do that because, um, well... If they got bigger, they would just jump out <laughs> really easily. We don't want that. Uh, oh, there's one. Okay. Boop. There you go. Alright. Yay. We're gonna go out, see if we can find another new slime. And we have a full empty inventory now. Yee. We're not getting the, uh... I don't know why I called them Lumos slimes. Phosphor slime. I'm not getting phosphor slimes. I'm gonna take some carrots with us in case something's hungry. And we can feed it and get some... I think the phosphor slimes, yeah, they only take fruit. They only like fruit. They don't need anything else. Alright, let's see. Um, so we have seen pinks and bunnies so far. And then the phosphor slimes. Let's go this way. This is where we came from last time when we got lost, sort of. I think. It stays nighttime for a while here. What is this? What is this thing? Activate? Oh, it's the map! Ooh. Okay, so this is where we are. There's a bunch of these places, so I can go off in those directions? I didn't even realize that. They might be closed off, though. That might just be extra parts to our farm. Get some more carrots. <gasps> yes! Tabby slimes! My namesake! No, I don't need you. Go away. Where? There are more rare somewhere. Hello? Press to activate. Oh. Refinery? What is this? Wild honey? I don't know what any of this stuff is. Refinery links. Refinery links conveniently transport resources and plorts. Oh! Oh! So if I put stuff in there, it'll bring it back to my place where there's stuff. I see. Get this fruit. <gasps> More tabbies! Gimme, gimme. Gimme. Come here. Come here. Oop. I didn't mean to take that chickadoo. E. I want the tabby floor. Yes. Give me more tabby. There he is. Come here. 
Come here. E. Clearly, these are my favorite. <laughs> oh, there's fruit up there. Let me. Mm. Yes. Oh, stony hands. Um, heck. Well, we don't really need the fruit for the moment, so I'll get rid of the fruit for the stony hens. See the um, tabby slimes, their favorite food is the stony hen. They love the stony hens. What is this up here? Was this the other... Eh. Yay! Other part of the map. We got it. Okay. I want more tabby slimes. Another stony hen. So as long as we get a stony hen or two, we can make more of them. Where are you? I walked right past it earlier. So I was over in my... So I was... I was so in over my head when I first started here. I remember hauling Jellystone back to the conservatory by hand because I was so excited. Breathless and sweating, I was going about everything all wrong, but I was happy. There's little time now, so I'll need these refinery links if I'm going to be efficient. This time I'm going to do it right. Okay. Am I going to pop that in there? Oh! So it just it puts those ports in there and these things if I find them, so I can pick them up back home. So I have more space. Hmm. So I can probably go get that fruit I just knocked out of everything. I think it's up here. Hello, little chicken. Oh, come here. <laughs> oh, one more. There we go. I like to have a nice rounded number of ten. There we go. We get this fruit back. I don't know if we're going to need it for anything necessarily, but we might give it to the pinks just to, you know, keep them happy. Oh, we already have ten, so we don't need another one. For now. I feel like 10 is generally the magic number when it comes to uh, slimes in a pen. Anymore, and it's a bit too much to handle. Sorry, buddy. I can't take your plort. We'll go back. He's hungry. <laughs> We'll go give these to our pinks. We'll give these carrots to our bunny slimes. And we'll end it with possibly, hopefully, if we have the money for it, put it in making a pen for our tabby slimes. Tabby slime. Yay. Though there is a slime in this game that looks more like me than the tabby slimes do. Uh, but that one's a little harder to get. So we'll, we'll see if we can find that at some point. Yes. These fruits. For the pinks. Pinks! Eat your fruits! There we go. We're gonna put these stony hens away. Yeah. Then we'll take these carrots. Give them to the bunnies. There you go, buddies. We're gonna go back over here real quick. Grab these... Anybody in here who's still hungry? You can usually tell because they kind of drool, like that one. And they'll jump out. Come back, come back. You can't, you can't do that. You can't be doing that. Here. Gluttonous little critters they are. Alright. Let me just scoop them all up. Give me that. Okay. Now we go put that away. In here. Yeah. Alright, now we go get the ones from the... This little guy. Cotton slimes. I forget what they're called. I'm gonna just call them bunny slimes probably for the most part. more carrots in here, because there's ten of them. How, what are you up there for? Get down. 
Oh, there we go. One of these is still hungry. There we go. That should be all of them. Bad. That's ten floors for ten cotton slimes. I'm gonna put these in here. Yeah, that's a good amount of money. Alright. Now we will make another corral. Yes. Tabbies. Yay. Look at them. They're so cute. Hello, little kitty friends. Let me go get you some chimkin. Yes. Uh, you, you. There you go, guys. So if you give them their favorite food, they give you two plorts instead of one. I forgot to mention that. They love the, the stuff they love, they'll give you two, two plorts for it. You guys are gonna eat that chicken? Yeah, excuse me, sir. How did you guys get out? Come back in. I guess they're gonna leave that chicken in there. Oh, wait. Nope, they ate it. <laughs> There we go. Got it. Thank you. Alright. Very good. Um... So... Oh, <laughs> guys! What are you doing? Go back in, please. I want more carrots. There you go. So, I think, uh, out of everything... These guys probably need the high walls the most. So we're just gonna buy a high wall right now. There we go. Because they're right next to the chickens, and I don't want them eating all of their chickens. I think the next thing on our to-do list after this will be to make a store. How did I just... How did I... I just said you guys can't go out. Come on now. Behave yourselves. They must have jumped out beforehand. Um... The next thing we'll be to do to make a storage thing so we can put all these carrots and things and stuff in there. I don't know how much the storage thing is. Let me see. Silo. 450. So that'll be a, a big thing to make, but we should be making that. I want to make the walls high on everybody's pens and then um, get the storage thing going. Let's feed these little dudes. Here you go, guys. I feel like they eat a lot more in this version of the game, or in this second one, than they did in the first one. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm wrong. It just seems that way. E. All right. Welcome right. back. Wait, somebody was out. Hey, you. What you doing out of there? And eventually we'll get. Um, pens that have a top on it so they literally can't jump out no matter how hard they try. Uh, yep. Alright. So, I think that's going to be it for now. Yeah! Um, Tabby's cat tip of the day, today, is um, to make your cat more comfortable in your home, uh, you should give them their own stuff. And I don't just mean, like, toys. Because, I mean, yeah, cats will like toys, and that'll help. But I mean, like, stuff that they can put their smell on. Like, uh, beds, cat trees, blankets, shelves, uh, little houses, you know, just little places for them to be. Stuff that's for cats, you know? You have your own furniture, they should have their own furniture. That way, you know, it actually looks like a cat lives in your house, you know? I wouldn't, if I lived somewhere, I wouldn't want it to make it, I wouldn't want people to forcefully try and make it look like I didn't live there. Like they were ashamed of me or something, you know? Um, so yeah, get your cat stuff. They like it, it makes them more relaxed, more calm, makes them feel more like they're part of your home, and make their, your home feel more like their home, too. So yeah, uh, that's going to be it for today. Cats and kittens. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye!